Hey, what's going on everyone? Back here with another Age of the Ring cast. We're doing a 4v4. And I saw someone's right. Best for a harem charge ever. And I'm like, I gotta look at this shit. <laughs> oh, hopefully it loads. I've been having some issues with, um, with me the last couple of days. It keeps crashing. Like, I tried to do a siege map. And it just kept crashing. Oh, my lord. So, we've got Rivendell. Oh, it's good old king. Uh, we've got Rohirrim, there's the White Hand. We've got Dol Guldur, there's Men of Dale. And uh, we've got the Real Stow. <laughs> and then we've got Torin. Uh, Excelsior. Silver. And El Elvi. <laughs> Alright, let's have a look. So we did the standard start by the looks of it. Some of them have gone for their powerpoints. Jesus, it's a lot of shit to cover. <laughs> Alright, so. Rohan, three farms, off the bat. Same with Rivendell. Alright, uh, Double Door, a couple farms. With their cursed end moot thingy, whatever. What is that actually called? A... Fount of Corruption, okay. And then, yep, got a couple of melon trees, we've got a forge. Let's go, let's have a look up here. Erebor, getting out some good old mines, nice and early. Wait, is there two Erebors? Yeah, there is. <laughs> Alright, same sort of thing, so they got a forge at the back. Lothorian. Looking pretty bare, which is a couple of melon trees, three melon, and a uh, thing for upgrades, forge. Then Gondor, we've got a couple of farms. Yeah. Alright, let's see what's happening in the middle. <laughs> we've got an early pivot. Uh, Mary, I knew that, shut up. <laughs> Alright, um, yeah, I had to turn the graphics down, hopefully it won't crash, because I tried to do a fortress map, and it just crashed. It was about to win too, it just pooped itself. Didn't give me an error or anything. Oh. Oh. Uh. Am I nuts? I thought a well had to be close by to do that. Like, I thought the mill had to be right, right next to it to do that. Okay, okay, okay. Right. No cluster fucks up here. Mary's like, I got this, lads. Don't even worry about it. Right. So both Rivendells have their wisdom of the elder. Uh, All right. Whoa, Gondor's gone for repair off the bat. I don't think I've ever seen anyone do that. Alright, we got some action happening. Fight to the last man. Fight for your lives. People that own that farm are probably like, oh, mate. I've got some yellow in here. Ooh, they are. I always forget about them. Here we go. Alright then. Rohirrim charge. Oh, they're gonna kill their farm. Condor are feeling it. Oh, get wrecked. <laughs> oh, I felt that. How you all doing? I hope you're having a good day. Let me know how you're doing in the comments down below. Mary's taking back his fucking thing. 
It's like, uh, I'm getting shot at. I don't even care. Just have a little dance while arrows get paled into him. Oh, oh, they're just full blade destroying it. It's a viable option. All right. I have no idea how this ends, I just know there's a cool Rohirrim charge in it. So like, take that as you will. <laughs> bye bye farm. So we got some early harassment happening. A lot of Erebor units sort of running about. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, they're gonna take the walk pit. Probably, probably got it. What's up here? building wells and stuff so they're probably gonna try and build up there and sneak around oh we got two stables out so yeah that's a thing whoa look at it look at it There we go. All right. That would be a bird. I like birds. <coughs> Lotharina finally making an advance. Gondor, again. Oh, they got pikes. Run. Who's leading them? That's that guy, Ramil. Rumil? <laughs> Ramil. <laughs> I, don't, I, I don't know. Alright. That's uh, King Brand. Which is Bard's grandson, I believe. <laughs> Could be wrong, but I think it is his grandson. Oh! It makes sense because this is based around the War of the Ring and um, Bard was probably in his 30s during The Hobbit and The Hobbit 60 is later so I'm guessing yeah it's his grandson or at least his son. Got some little action happening up here and up here so this one doesn't seem as exciting as down here. Look at all that Rohirrim. Beautiful. Oh. Ru hero to the king Gandalf already Fuck that's mad That's insane They saved up their pennies clearly Alright Ooh everyone seems to have a bit of money Uh I can't believe they went for rebuild off the bat. Like, it seems like a really strange thing to go for first. I, I guess I can help with farm. Like, I guess I can slow down their creeping. But, uh... You only get one... Like, you have to wait for it to recharge and stuff. So, like, is there a point? There's, like, a clusterfuck up here. Give me all your money. It's a very nice little map. All right. All righty, let's go down here. They're coming around. Coming around. 4v4s are interesting because they can either they can go for ages but they also like if one side loses some really early on it can crumble very quickly because once it becomes a 4v3 it doesn't only end too well what's going on up here oh 
Oh dear. Gandalf's like, get away from my farm! Fuck! Who's that? It's Faramir. I don't think I've ever put him on his horse in this mod. He looks cool. Alright, back up here. I always just use Invartory, that's Aragorn. Son of Arathon. And Aragorn's gonna die! Oh, rip Aragorn. There's two, like, pretty neato battles going on. So, I don't... Uh, that one's pretty much over. This one seems to be an absolute cluster. Oh, Gandalf's gonna die. Oh, no! Fuck! I felt that from here. <laughs> I didn't pay by a spear. Absolutely fucked. There done. Oh, let's go up here. There's nothing there. Alright. More red coming. These guys, like, there may not be many of them, but they are very powerful. If you pair them with Amar and Theoden. Cool build a kill, by the way. Uh, you're, gonna, you're in for some fun. So be sure to check out my second channel where I do walkthroughs and other side projects. Basically anything non Lord of Rings and Star Wars games go on that channel. For now on. So, you're not forced to watch stuff you don't want to watch here. Damn. Yeah. Damn wives. Curse. They're not the... Ents aren't the best siege, but they're handy. But another thing with Ents, Ents can actually defend themselves. <laughs> Catapults can't. <laughs> so there is a upside to it. Alright. Oh, that's that's a lot of Lake Town people. Lake Town? Barding Longbow. Barding Phalanx. I'm guessing Lake Town? Uh, Arab Boar Assembly. Hmm. The ants are coming in. Guys, I forget how good their longbows are. I think they've gone Ogin Shield though. Uh, Iron Foot. Nazgul. Come on. The only named Nazgul. Unless you count the Witch King, but that's not his original name. So, Kamal's <laughs> the only one that we like know for certain who he was. I think it's said that three or six of the Nazgul were Numenorean kings. I can't remember if it's three or six, but like, yeah, it happens. Down, down, down we go. Oh, I thought their base had been destroyed for a second. I was going to say, I missed something. <laughs> They're still just running around, fucking everyone over. That's a lot of heroes. <laughs> Man. Hear him charge for death and glory. <clears throat> All right. Yep, yeah, they're just gonna harass the fuck out of kind of up here. Still a cluster. Oh, you bastards! <laughs> that does not last long. Oh. 
Right, they're on the back foot. You're on the same team, why are you running the other way? What are you doing? Alright, what's up here? Stop. Come on, come on, come on! Oh, shit! Are these guys back? Ah, this thing's copyright. I don't know what game I was like. I think it's the War of the Ring game? Or something? No, it was a mod for um, Total War, a Lord of Rings mod. They made a version of the patch without copyright music, specifically for streamers. I'm like, that is really nice of them. I'm actually thinking of playing the Total War Lord of Rings mods. Let me know if you want me to. We'll have a look. More Lord of Rings content. After two towers, I'm either going to get Third Age or Lord of Rings Lego. We've got Shadow of War going at the same time as well. Alright. More are coming. Oh. Kimmel. They might actually go down. Right. Their fortress might at least. Ahahaha! <laughs> Look at that, you cheeky bastards. Uh, I think they did it themselves. Oh my god, that's gonna hurt. That is, that's, that's just cruel. We're out of re rebuilds now, though, so... Oh, that's... that's just... That's cruel. Alright. Oh, here comes Rohirrim! For death and glory! Plus the fuck. I hear a Gimli. Love that one. Damn! Gimling Warriors. I remember them. I swear sometimes I'm a goldfish. It's like, oh, new things. <laughs> So we're here armies not even that big, but they just rip everything that trades cut buffs. But yeah, I'll try to do some custom maps again. I just really don't know what to do if it keeps crashing. It's really annoying. Give it a go though. Uh, I've got a couple of custom maps I want to try out. I keep this. Yeah, I'll fiddle with the graphics a bit more to see if that helps. Um, I've got most of it, pretty much everything turned down. I've only got a couple of things on high. So I don't quite know. That's a big face. Ha <laughs> ha! That's such a dickish move. I was about to say a word a lot more horrible. <laughs> My family's part Australian, part British. So we swear a lot. <laughs> like, it is so normal here, like, to just run your mouth, like. It's, it's, it's different, I'll tell you that. Numenorean Stonewall. Gandalf is the middle, in the middle of that. Damn, boy. I think they're still in the game. I don't think they. Yeah, they're, they're not. They're still in the game. Whoop. Aaron in his PJs. Haha, <laughs> Peter Jackson. <laughs> Alright, let's go. 
I have to say, Hugo Reaving wasn't the best choice for Elrond. And I feel like he tried his hardest, but I think he wasn't given the best direction. Because he was grumpy, angry, and not very nice. And Elrond's meant to be really kind and wise and level-headed. Like... <laughs> He went from being Agent Smith to Elrond. It was a bit of a... It was one of the weirdest decisions. But he, he did alright. Sorry, I go on tangents. What? <laughs> Let me know if you actually like me just like telling stories or like just sort of randomly talking about random shit. Because like... I'm, I'm good at that. <laughs> Whoop. There's not much left of his base, but he has builders. And half an army. For death and glory. Uh, I don't really want to miss out on the Rohirrim charge by looking at other shit. Pretty sure Amos got a charge as well. Yeah. Uh, uh, a ring which gives. Okay. Yep, you can do that. Alright. They're building statues. The game just has literally just tapered off there. Like everything's just gone from being really action packed to chill as fuck. I would be trying to push the offensive on Erebor if I could. It's quite an army though, so that creates issues. You could always try and focus on Gondor and make them retreat. Hmm. But yeah. Well, like you guys try and hold down Gondor and have the yellow go around and get their base while they're distracted, I don't know. Oh, yay! Oh, God. Please don't crash. Oh, my God! And the red dawn! Oh. Oh. That was rude. We're here. Um. Wow, that is such a cluster. Oh my god. Like, holy crap. That was... It was almost really depressing. Jesus Christ. That. Alright. A blue cracker doom. Oh, they're still fucking kicking. Jesus. Theoden. Where's the rest of them? Um. Yeah, I, th I think I know who's gonna win. <laughs> oh! Necro. The Necromancer. Oh! Get slapped. They're still... They're clinging on. They're giving it their all. Oh, what's going on over here? Yeah, they're going to be a bit more annoying to take down. <laughs> and the wrecked dawn. Oh. them, right? Uh. Alright, um. Uh, a 
but it's basically all they've got left, I think, and the forge. But the forge does not count as like a, or does it? Does it? Unless they've got some shit. Ah, there's some white there. Ah, smart. <laughs> Poor Rohan lost like the majority of their army. <laughs> oh, that's a lot of catapults. I oh, know Rivendell are gonna build over here. Yeah, these give you resources, and people like I tend to forget that. Slowly plus a tick too, which is <clears throat> more than any farm. Unless you have like grand harvest or something. No, I think even with like grand harvest and 100%, it would not give you 30 a tick. Could be wrong, I'm not sure. Well, they didn't just give up, so that's kind of good to see. We've got more coming. Jesus Christ. Yeah, they are building more. Alright, cool. Alright, more Rohirrim! Now that farm's gonna go down in about 30 seconds. That's a lot of pikemen. All they can do is just run away, really. Ah, Rivendell, coming to the rescue. Alright. This 4v4 is dragging out nicely. Quick games are cool, but they're also a bit, like, underwhelming. It's like, oh... That went for 10 minutes, cool. Oh shit! <coughs> Big Spidey! Holy crap! Fuck! Don't make vagina jokes. <laughs> oh lordy lordy. Yeah, that's very well defended. Dwarves are known for their defences. Dollary dues. Yeah, that didn't stay on fire very long. Oh, here come the ants. <laughs> that is terrifying. And that's coming from me. I live in a country literally full of fucking spiders. Man, it's not fun. It's, it's not. Oh, shit. Oh, my god. Riders of Snowborn. Snowborn? Yeah. Why is it called Snowborn? Is it just snowy there and they went, yep, that's what we call it. Someone actually can tell me, I want, I'm cu I'm generally curious for why they call it Snowborn. What the fuck happened? Did they just all quit life? Except for Gondor. Oh, like, what the fuck? Ow. That'd be a dead dwarf. That is hard to watch. Oh my god, it's that guy. This guy is fucking terrifying. He's like a giant goat. Skinwalker or something. I don't know. I think he's... I don't know, I don't know. He's fugly, put it that way. Alright. Gondor, you're the last fence. Wow, that's an erection if I've ever seen. Uh. Uh. Wow. 
Why do you have such a putty mouth? Because. So, they have... Fuck, they're not going out without a fight. I like that. So, some strong fighting spirit. Faramir is like absolutely glitched. And because everything's so close together, oh, they're catapults hitting the fortress. It's kind of annoying to attack. What the fuck? I guess, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. It broke at the end. We'll see you next time. And goodbye for now. Really sorry. But we know who was going to win. Welcome to the end of the video. Shout out to my lovely patrons. You keep the stream alive. Even a dollar per month is a lot of help and it goes a really long way. And thank you all for essentially getting me to this point. We've recently passed 500 subscribers. Woo. And yeah, this is... So I'm making a new outro. So we have a few Discord servers here we would like to show off. Um, this is my private Patreon discord server if you're a patreon you get access to this depending on your level but um even one dollar a month you get that access to most stuff just like uh we've got videos youtube playlists beyond the scenes which i just like generally drop stuff all the time like nice beyond the scenes stuff and uh, we've got our main server here and um once again, links to pretty much everything, co-owned with Nadaline. So we've got news, wool mod content, other game content. Pretty much a bit of everything for everyone. And don't and forget to go look at my social media, I'm very active on all of them. There should be some screenshots popping up, but yeah, go check them out. Thank you all for watching, I hope you enjoyed the video. Goodbye for now.